The degenerative disease itself, its effect on motor neurons, it's not, it's not directly painful. But when textbooks say ALS doesn't hurt, I, I think that's a misconception because the results of ALS can be painful. So not the death of motor neurons, but you know, the fact that somebody's shoulder atrophies and all those muscles that used to help hold up the weight of the arm are gone. And now the weight of the arm is just pulling down on the shoulder capsule. And as a result, people can have horrendous pain in some of their joints. Um, you know, people that can't move around in bed that are just stuck in one place. I mean, they get pain and pressure points. So I would say that over the course of the disease, most of my patients have experienced pain, but it's not pain from the loss of motor neurons. It's pain from other things. And so it's one of the questions that we always ask about pain. And then we try to understand what is the cause of the pain and we treat the pain differently depending upon the cause. We don't just blast everybody with narcotics because sometimes it's a piece of equipment like a sling to take the weight off that shoulder joint or an alternating pressure pad mattress topper that moves people around just slightly so they're not just stuck in those pressure points all night long.